what should be done by one skilled in goodness who has comprehended the state of peace. He ought to be able, straight, upright, easy to speak to, soft and humble, satisfied with little, easy to support, free from duties, and simple in living, with the sense faculties at peace, he is wise, discreet, without greed, for the donors and families. He should not do the slightest thing that others who are wise might find fault with him. May all beings be happy and secure. May all beings in their hearts be happy, happy, happy. Whatever breathing beings there are, trembling, firm, or any other, whether they be long or great, of middle size, short or small, those who are seen and those who are unseen, those who live far away and those who are near, those who are born and those who still seek birth. May all beings in their hearts be happy. No one should cheat another, nor should he despise anyone, anywhere. He should not wish suffering on another because of anger or resentment. In the same way, as a mother would protect her child, her only child, with her life. So too, towards all beings, should one develop the measureless mind of loving kindness. Towards the entire world, he should develop the measureless mind of loving kindness. Above, below, and all across, without barriers, hate, or enmity. Standing, walking, sitting, or lying down for as long as he is clear and awake. He should resolve on this mindfulness. For this, they say, here, is a true spiritual life. Without going near wrong view, he is virtuous and endowed with true insight. Having removed greed towards sense pleasures, he will never come back into the womb again. By the statement of this truth, may I be happy. By the statement of this truth, may all beings be happy. By the statement of this truth, may all beings be happy. Sadu, sadu, sadu.